Why are guys afraid of being moist? What's something a girl can do that she just has a moon button? Are you guys willing to wait till marriage? How do you guys get over breakups? Are you guys pro-life or pro-choice? Would you guys date a girl that's taller than you? What do you guys think about your girlfriends or like your babes having male best friends? Why is it okay for guys to play babes like basketball? But when is a girl, she belongs to the street. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> is this you? A most guy who I'm being on this pro life. Eh? I mean pro choice, mistake, mistake. This guy is short so I feel I feel I feel I just I feel I just slapping you. Just short so Are you ready? Let's go! Hi guys, we are me from show. Welcome and welcome back to my channel. Some guests with me, and we're going to be doing a collab with Dante's channel. And we're going to be asking guys questions girls are too afraid to ask. I'm going to have all my guests introduce themselves right about now. Oh, Zachary Ryan, the Ryan with the double E. Yeah. Dante, make sure to follow me on all my social media. It's going to be down below. And uh, make sure to subscribe to my channel, like, comment, and share. Chikamara, it's basically that's just it. Uh, my name is Ibukun. You know the vibes, like you can call me the magnificent in the street. So <laughs> this guy wants to go and enhance his voice. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, it's SB. Um, I don't know if they put my links to the music, but. Go check that shit out ASAP. Okay, so now next, this question I have to explain properly. So, like, on a scale of one to ten, yeah, like, if you're trying to get a baby, like, how soft do you want her to be? And this is why I'm asking this. I've had a guy say, like, oh, he doesn't want his babe to be too fine, so he doesn't have to worry about like other guys looking at her. So, like, would you want your babe to be fine? People don't like competition. <laughs> and the guy wants easy competition. Ah, <laughs> come on, come on. So like on the scale of what's ten, how soft, how soft do you want her to be? Ten. I can't lie, ten. Cause yeah, you still have to worry. Cause I can't lie, start to worry regardless, man. If you're trying to bag a babe, you have to be careful. Cause like, when you bag her, you you have to go and like you know show her off to the world. You know, take you snaps and everything. And if you don't rate her, then duh. exactly like why would you date someone you don't rate? Like you don't want to show up. That's true. You can't date someone you don't rate. Like, I mean, there's a difference between like keeping it low key and shit, but like, why do you not date someone like you're not proud of? They like, like, they ask you, you, you show your friends your babe, they now they not say, Oh, that's her. They not say, Oh, no, this picture doesn't do her justice. They'll be like, Oh, okay. <laughs> 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 Is this you? Nah, man, nah. They'll be nah, like, nah. like, Oh, she looks, she looks nice. Nah. Yeah. Are you yeah, sure? You got to okay, yeah, they'll hit you. Bad. They'll hit you. Bad. They will hit you with that. Oh, she's calm. That calm. See, C A L M. She's calm. When, when, he, when he get oh, he's like ah, forget you. Fucked up. Okay, now next question is like, why are guys afraid of being moist? <laughs> like, why is it guys like to do oh hard guy? They don't want to be soft. They don't want to be you know emotional or vulnerable. Like, what's that about? Is it ego? Like, is it cause it's just like it's just dead guy things? Like, what's that about? I'm a moist guy. Who, I'm a moist guy. <laughs> Moist, moist. I spend ni Nivea. It will come right away. <laughs> <laughs> the thing is, most of us, uh, most of us, it's just a facade. That hard guy is just like, it's just the exterior. But mm. if you're really like learning to fuck with the guy and it reveals like, there's always a moist, every guy has a moist side. No guy can be like hard 100%. Every guy has a moist side on the inside. I think for most people it's just a front, like it's just the first impression. Me, I know. My guys, my guys tell me, me, see, skin, me I'm moist. When you put when you put like that cold cold cold, cold, cold cream. Cold cold cream. When you put cold cream on your body. Bro, don't, don't be afraid. Don't be afraid to show your feelings. To all the people out there. Oh yeah, I, 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 and the thing is some guys might be afraid that like, they show their moist side to this babe that like, oh crown him or something i don't know bro see sometimes it's not even about being moist to the babe it's about being moist to your guys like if you're with your babe and you are doing oh cute stuff but your guys coming up be doing hmm hmm like what's that about uh-uh 
guy, it's more of the opposite thing. Cause like, if you're your babe and you're your guy, yeah, you have to, you have to flex. I feel like it depends, Sha. It depends. No. <laughs> See, this, this, because this relates back to that question. If I'm proud, if I'm proud of my girl, and, and yes. I'm with my guys, and I'm with my girl, ah, bro. All this Snapchat, all this PD, I hate it now, but if I get my own babe. Guys, we don't rumors. Everywhere, bro. Like, Snap, Twitter, Instagram, I'm posting everywhere. Taking videos, all that shit. Like. Guys, honestly, man, I can't even lie. My bitch is my babe, like. That PD thing is no piece sweet, though. It just has to be with the right babe. Next question. What gets you guys' moon button? Like, what's something a girl can do that she just has a moon button? Guys, you should lick my ear. Hi. Oh my god. <laughs> Sensational. What the hell? Nah, guys, that was double tried. You can cook like a goosey pounded yam, like, if you can cook like soup. Man. I will order pizza, Jerry. I feel like if you know how to call Joe, Sha. Guy, if you know how to console me. If you know how to be there. As in. No, see, let me not lie. When they used to, when they used to lick my ear, my ear used to go like this. My neck used to go like this. Yeah, ew. Scary. Scary! If you come to my ear, I just, I just, mm, 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 mm. That's it, mm. My own is that. I don't even know how you guys enjoy that pee, man. That. I can go for your ear, but don't, don't, don't go for my own. This is different. It's a different pee. People, people don't like people don't like good things, I baby. I hope you guys are taking note. Okay, now next question: Are you guys willing to wait till marriage? Like, if it's really important. For what? Ah, uh, uh, what do you mean by for what? No, for what are we waiting for? For wait, 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 wait for what? Uh. Is it too late? If you if you found a babe, yeah, and you just so in love with her and she wanted to wait to marriage, like would you guys Oh yeah, I'll oh, wait. Oh, that. First. I'll wait, wait to marriage for what? What the hell? Do, do, do I have to spell it out for you? Yeah. Like within that six months talking stage, I would have figured out and I would have dipped already. We could have been a good couple. We could have had something special. But you one crazy ass bitch. Like, it's like, fam, <laughs> like, it's not your six months, it's not your six months that you don't find out that you want to do anything, no. No, not do anything. Wait, are you talking about anything at all or just the... The, the main gong gong? The main as in, is that... The, la the lamba, the lamba. That one is calm, Sha, but if you do any other thing, then... So exactly, they know for you, are running when you're dipping. No, no, it's like... You have to reason it. If the baby is worth it, definitely. But like at the same time, no, I'll stay. I'll stay. What if she wasn't waiting to marriage with another person? You get me? That's a lost cause. It's a lost cause. You get. You get. You get. My life, my guy. This life, you no balance. So. As in this life, you no balance. So. Talking about other girls, but this girl that I'm talking about here, just a random. She just wants to wait to marry with everybody. She just wants to wait to marriage. Yeah, that's fine. I'm with this. That's fine. It's fine. As in, if she's worth it, then I wait. Okay, so now, next question is how do you guys get over breakups? Like, if you guys, break, let's say, like a one year relationship, hey, hey, like, what hey. are you doing to get over her? I can't, I can't advise guys on this, P. It's a lot, it's a lot of factors. Come on, welcome to the streets, man. Welcome to the streets. Thank you. That's why the streets. This way you need to go after that breakup, bro. Alright. gonna have okay. a we don't give a fuck! Yeah. Jesus! We don't give a fuck! Go and turn up, go and turn up. Enjoy, enjoy. <laughs> go and catch crews. You need four weeks full worth of silver fox. That's what you need to get over. This is life now. Next question. Are you guys pro-life or pro-choice? Let me explain it. Pro-life means you think abortion is like just like a sin or it's crazy like a baby should always be born Even if she was raped, even if she was too young, like pro-life is the baby must be born in general And pro-choice is, is the girl's body, she does what she wants with it So what are you guys on? She does what she wants, baby Exactly, pro-life Eh? I mean pro-choice, mistake, mistake Okay, 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 cool, cool, cool 
Brut choice, brut choice, brut choice. Choice, choice, like. Brut choice. If I'm being on this pro life, but do what you want. Dante, what did you say? You're starting to irritate me now. I said if I'm being on this pro life for me, but do what you want. Can't lie. Each to their own rest. Ah. Uh, what should just rip? Yeah, I can't lie. I think, I think I'm pro choice. I just don't talk about it now for like first time. I think I'm pro choice. See, no, like, I'm not going to talk about whatever she gets to it, but like, each to their own pro life because each to their own, let's end it there, beg. No, no, no. There's not any day, there are circumstances. There's not, there's not any day. What do you mean pro life? Why pro life? You have to explain. Me, my own is just that that baby you're killing sometimes. Like, sometimes I just be thinking that baby you're killing. What if he's the one to find COVID killing? This guy is short, so. Shut up. I feel, I feel, I feel, I just, I feel, I just slapping you. Just shut up. I feel, I feel, I just slapping this guy. Honestly, honestly, what are you all about? I beg, Dante, Dante, after this, I beg, plug me, plug me, plug me, you're your dealer. 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 you Yeah, so I'm about to like finish editing this video, but I wanted to come on here and really explain what Dante was trying to say. Basically, my guy was trying to say that he could not advocate either pro life or pro choice because it depends on its situations. And what he was saying was that it's literally to each their own. Since he hasn't been in a situation to decide whether he's pro life or pro choice, he was basically saying that everyone should be able to decide for themselves and to literally each their own. So people who find themselves in situations he would say whether they are pro life or pro choice, but he could not really put his mouth and say he's pro life or pro choice because it's not in his place to be like, oh, you know what I mean? So he was not trying to say, like, oh, he's pro life, but at the same time, he was not saying he was pro choice, but he's saying to each their own and depends on people who find themselves in situations like that. But I just want to clarify that before Dante got dragged in the comments because we're not doing that, you know, cancellation over here. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the rest of the video. Bye. Okay, now, do you guys believe in like being feminist? Like, are you guys feminists? Do you believe in like equality for male and female? I don't see. I don't see how you can't be a feminist. Yeah. For real, like, are we in the 18th century? Yeah, I'm all for equality. Like, seriously. I'm so proud. Word, 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 word. But there's some guys that saying women can't do men's job. Like, can you be bricklayer? Guy, that's contradicting. I can't lie. You. Yes, I can. If I was being a bricklayer, I'll be a bricklayer. That's it. That's the full stop. Period. 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 Yeah, because honestly, like I would like that whole the whole the whole Nigerian marriage system for like that that Adeboy, Adeboy thing he said yesterday I was so upset. Ah, that thing was dumb. I can't lie. It's like that's how that's how lots of marriages in Nigeria are. Yeah, that's why we're exposed. That's why we know better now. We, we can. I feel like it's all like. This one is like let's change change the game. Yeah, we need to we need to change that we need to we need to change that p. It's not the same. Not nah, for real, for real. Okay, now next question is: Why is it okay for guys to play babes like basketball? But when is a girl? She belongs to the streets. What's that about? Boys belong to the streets too. No, yeah, but like. Yeah, game is game. Guys are praised for belonging to the streets, but if it's a girl, it's a different case. Why is that? Yeah, game is game. You do what you want, guy. Regardless. I mean, it's society. It's society. You guys don't believe that girls belong to the streets like it's bad. Like she can do what she wants. Yeah, it's your life, man. No, I'm honest, like the babe should do what she wants, I can't lie. Don't worry about your body count, let your body bounce. Body bounce, don't worry about your body count, let your body bounce. Don't worry about your body count, let your body bounce. Let your body bounce. Let it bounce, baby. Period, okay, let's go. Okay, next question. What do you guys think about your girlfriends or like your babes having male best friends? That's fine. Hmm, red flag. Red flag. The male best friend has to be my friend. That's the only condition. What if you don't know the babe's friend? That's even worse when it's your friend and he's knocking your own babe. I say. I can't lie. Um, I don't know. It depends because I can't. Say, I can't come and say anything that like, because my two best friends are dating. So it depends on how close you guys are. Yeah, it's trust. Exactly. If you can trust her. If you trust the guy, I feel like you should have no word. I mean, believe in your source. Like exactly, believe in your source. You know, see, <laughs> and fine boys like us, 
people will not to look for women like that. Now they they rush us. Now they now they now they they rush us. Fam, let's have ten. 10 guys in the room, if you believe that you've hooked this babe, she really likes you. 10 guys in the room. They, uh, honestly, like if, if you're like that, you're like that. Exactly. You have no worries. If, you're, if your foundation and your work is solid, then you know to right. Yeah, this just boils down to say, if your babe is your babe, she wouldn't be with another man regardless. Would you guys date a girl that's taller than you? Yes. Like a height matter. God did not bless me too much vertically, so... I, to, you know, humble myself. I blame my dad too. It's my dad's fault as well. <laughs> but wow. if you're under six, it's like no matter. Like... It's life. It's life. Yeah, I'm not kind of like it's hard to find a babe that's taller than me. So it's like exactly it's hard. But like if I find a nice babe that's like my height, like six foot six one, like. There's no problem. But like, when she wears heels and clothes, we'll, we'll stand like six, six feet apart now. You know, coronavirus. <laughs> See, I don't mind looking. I don't mind looking up. Now, this is the last question. Friends with this couple, right? And the guys teaching on the girl. I guess tell the girl. I won't lie. That's my business. No, it depends. Girl, I'm staying. But it's not all my friends I'm going to tell. Like, I have, I have like a handful of friends that I'll tell you. It depends. That one's a tight corner. It depends, yeah. But if anybody else, because. You know, this game, man. Imagine imagine they are casting you. They are casting you for every fucking thing you do. Uh, can't lie. So that's it. If someone cheating on me, would you tell me? Is what I'm asking, basically. Genke. Oh, my. Oh, my. Okay, see. If... <laughs> okay, see. If the person... If I don't know the guy at all, I'll probably tell you. No, you that, no, you know the guy. Yeah. The, guy. The, guy. the guy is your friend. You know the guy. Let, me do? let me do now. Let me do now. If one of these guys there, I was sitting there, my sister on me, would you tell me? Bro code. Don't put me in that situation. <laughs> this is too tight. Baby, baby. Let me tell you something. If I'm being honest, I understand how close we are, but I'll give you a hint. I'll have to give you a hint. I'll give you a hint. I can't lie. But I won't say flat out because I don't like being in those kind of situations. I'll just be like guy, be careful though. Like and you ask man, I'll just try and dare the conversation. You never ask again. So you're just yeah, like quite genuine. Because I don't want to be in the middle because I me I don't even really like Facts. being hard brain. I have nah, so I like been in being the in the middle. Do you get it too much? Okay, guys. So this is the end of part two of this video. If you enjoyed, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and leave a comment. And also tell us who your favorite character was out of all the boys.